We are so excited to be here on the first day of We Build. This is a dream almost two years in the making where we sat down and said, what can we do that centers Black women entrepreneurs? Black women are the fastest growing segment of entrepreneurs in the country, but they still don't get near enough resources. They get half of a percent of venture capital, and that's a narrative we're definitely trying to rewrite. <laughs> So you guys will be able to select uh, which session you would be at. We're so thankful to our sponsors, especially the Golden Sachs, George Krauser Family Foundation, Schusterman Family Philanthropies, Google, as well as the Lesher family who made this program possible. We Build is dedicated to Black women, and we're doing this program differently. We're not just pouring into their companies, we're pouring into these founders. All of these women will get the benefit of legal expertise, accounting expertise, marketing expertise, as well as some financial literacy. And we're also gonna help take care of the whole woman. We're providing access to mental health while they're in this program. We know being a founder is hard. We know imposter syndrome is real, especially for black women founders. And so we're trying to address all of those barriers that keep them from their success. I can't say enough what this program has meant to develop, to grow, to steward, and now to see it in action. Um, the comments from the women today about being here, being in the home of Black Wall Street, being together, their faces when they got to see their WeBuild hats and their brand new MacBook Airs. Um, it has just made this such a wonderful experience. I can't wait to see what they do with these tools, with these resources, with this education as they continue to grow these businesses. You have a cohort number one. You are setting the tone. Period. 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 We're going to go through all the information about this workspace. Our community has over 2,000 members a part of it, and our ultimate mission is to support entrepreneurs who have an economic impact in Tulsa. Nice to meet you all, and I'd love to learn more about your businesses as you go through the next couple of months. We kind of easing you in a little bit this first week because we want to do A to kind of like gel as a cohort. You guys are going to be your road dogs, you know what I mean? These are the people that are gonna be with you through this process. You should be able to lean on each other and learn from one another. We all know that entrepreneurship can be super lonely. And so the reason we do this kind of in a cohort is to try to combat some of that. Providing you access and exposure, as long, along with a little bit of cash, along with the connections, along with the networking, along with the sprints about product market fit. Tulsa was home to the most black millionaires of anywhere else in the country in 1921. That is your history. That is your legacy. And ma'am, that is your destiny. That is what we are here for. You are not an anomaly. You are not an aberration. You come from this. I have had a great first day meeting some phenomenal, phenomenal women who are part of this cohort, as well as getting some great gifts and bonuses, plus a MacBook, y'all. Oh my gosh. So I am just so ha excited and happy to be here and ready to take my business to the next level. Thank you, WeBuild. I think it's important for us as Black women to be in community with each other and to learn from and build with each other. So I'm really excited. It is such an honor to be a part of the WeBuild cohort. I was elated today to meet some game changers black women who are rebuilding Black Wall Street. I'm honored to be in this community and can't wait for all that's in store. And I just feel so lucky to be building 
Black Wall Street here in Tulsa. Uh, it's, a, it's an incredible feeling. I know for a fact that I'm going to grow because they say, as you say, iron sharpens iron. And I'm here to soak up as much knowledge as I can within the program. I am incredibly honored to be a part of a community with bold Black businesswomen who are creating uh, legacy and generational wealth, not only for themselves, but for the communities at large. When I walked in the space, I was like, oh, is this going to be my new home? <laughs> you can tell that there's so much intention and so much care, so much love that's put into it. Um, meeting all of the women really is fueling me. My first Ma uh, MacBook, so <laughs> uh, this is a first for me. <laughs> I wanna be in a place where, you know, we're celebrated, sort of not just like tolerated. And I feel like that's what's happening here in Tulsa. It means a lot to be able to build in my hometown, in Greenwood, with Building Tulsa. I have really been enamored with this city with its focus on entrepreneurship, with its focus on the growth and development of the Black community as well as the Black entrepreneurship community. And being a part of this ecosystem is very uplifting. I actually didn't find out about the history of Black Wall Street and Greenwood until just a few years ago, unfortunately. So to be here a few years later and to actually be part of something that is working to rebuild that is I can't really even explain or put it into words how, how much that means to me. This is something that I know that as I grow old, this will be something that I will share with the ones that come after me of like, I was part of the rebuilding of the legacy of Black Wall Street. There's such power in this room. There really, really, really is. I cannot wait to see what y'all get into because I think it's going to be amazing. Yeah.